I'm Model T. I'm Paul Shin. And we just wanted to wish you a Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas. Now here's today's Ford Model A question of the day. Today's question comes from Neil. Hey, Neil. It's kind of a little bit long, but oh. here we go. He says he finally took the leap and purchased a 1931 narrow bed closed cab pickup truck. Yes. Woo. <laughs> All right. Good job. Okay, it runs and stops pretty well, but it's beyond what you've described as a hoopty. Oh, lovely, okay. Yeah. I have to search YouTube, <laughs> but have not found any videos that showed how to adjust door latches and what the correct fit is on the rear of the door where it overlaps. Can you provide any guidance and adjustment and what looks like a properly closed Model A door? Well, yeah, um, I'm going to have to do it on my coupe though, because my truck is still in a lot of pieces. It's in disarray. It's a kit. <laughs> but my coupe is together and I can show you because it's the exact same thing. Yeah. Exactly. So first of all, to adjust a latch, let me show you, let me bring you in tight. If you'll pardon my chipped up door frame here, these two screws right here are what adjust this catch. So if you loosen those up just a little bit and you can move this in or out and then tighten them up. And what you want is a door that closes like this easily with one finger. Just like that and you don't want it to come open okay so adjust that in or out so the door closes with one finger and doesn't pull open afterward as for door fitment the doors on a coupe pickup two door they overlap okay so this really doesn't tell you anything how much overlap there is what you need to do is you need to look at this line up here and this line down here align the door so that the top line is straight it should be straight with the body line on the body itself and down there, there shouldn't be any big gaps because there's a little rubber piece down at the bottom of the door that's supposed to rub up against this sill. And when you close the door, that rub should just be very slight. It shouldn't hit that rubber and the rubber should touch both sides. It shouldn't just glide right over the top of it. The way you adjust it is by tweaking these hinges. And in order to show that, I would have to get very violent with my car. But basically, you pull the door out here and you get violent with it. That's the way to adjust them. And we're on. On. Get it on. <laughs> Sounds like a Barry White song in the making. Yes. Let's get it on. <laughs> That's Marvin Gaye. Oh, is it Marvin Gaye? Yeah. Oh, you would know. <laughs> <laughs> you should know. <laughs> Usually Barry White has all the sexy songs. Yeah, Marvin Gaye had sexy songs too. Oh, I guess I haven't heard it in a so long time. So did Smokey time. Robinson. So did you know. Smokey Robinson yeah. has sexy songs? Yeah, a couple. Yeah. Okay. But nobody makes a sexy song like Barry White. <laughs> <laughs> Keep those Model A's driving for generations to come.